Champions League qualifiers coming up very soon against Legia Warsaw from Poland. We've just been at the FAI Cup draw. What were your thoughts when you, you learned who you're going to face in the Champions League qualifiers? Yeah, well, obviously it was going to be exciting, but we weren't expected to get any, you know, like uh, weaker teams. You know, it's the Champions League at the end of the day. They're the champions of each country, and uh, there's going to be no easy draws. Um, so, look, uh, Legia are a great team, you know, from Poland, the Polish champions, and uh, be a really tough game. Um, so we're really looking forward to it, but as I said there, the uh, most important thing is we'll get uh, Friday out of the way first and hopefully we can get the three points for them. Yeah, Dave, of course, played Dundalk recently in European competition as well and your manager, John Caulfield, did say that he thought it was the toughest draw that could have come out of the pot. What was the, the kind of view of the players w when it came out and, and you're going to go to Poland to play in a fantastic stadium in front of a big crowd and they're going to come to uh, Cork in a couple of weeks' time, 7,000 fans, it'll be their first competitive game and um, they probably don't know what they're going to expect when they come to Turner's Cross. No, well, look, as a player, uh, like any player, uh, you want to play at the highest standard that you can, that you're capable of. And um, like uh, for us, like uh, playing the Champions team, uh, like a uh, Champions League against the uh, uh, champions of Poland, um, like uh, they're obviously a great team. And uh, like uh, you want to test yourself. So hopefully that we can apply ourselves right and uh, like a uh, set up right and uh, hopefully that we can get a result that we need. It's been such a busy league period with so many games packed in and, and then the break, of course. But... To have Europe on the horizon must be very exciting as a player, especially it being Cork's first time in the Champions League as opposed to the Europa League and everything that goes with that. It's a, it's probably what you play football for, really. Yeah, well, it is. Like it's exciting times for the club, you know, and uh, for the players as well. Uh, we're really looking forward to it. So, like every game, like uh, we treat every game as a big game, and uh, hopefully that we can get the result on Friday night. And uh, really look forward to it then next Tuesday. Lastly, Connor, how are you handling the heat and how are the players handling the heat? I'm roasting here, we're in the Aviva, the aircon is on and it's still absolutely roasting. There's been water breaks in the League of Ireland for the first time I can ever remember. They'll probably be the same this Friday. You've been obviously full-time training in the in the mornings, 12 noon, it's very warm. How have you handled it? It is, like it is tough, you know, uh, like even training sessions, you know, the training go on for an hour and a half and stuff and like uh, it does be difficult. Um, you obviously have to uh, take on board as much water as you can, you know, to recover. Um, you know, and then staying out of the heat then after training, you know, relaxing and uh, getting yourself prepared.